All right, Brewers Cards over here. Hopefully I'm on. I don't know. There we go. That's... What? I don't know. Anybody see me out there? What's going on? Oh, not. Nah, why is it? Okay. Sorry it says reminder. And sorry I'm late because this whole setup, the whole internet was not mess or, or was messing with me. Hey, Criterion or Racer, what's going on, man? Thanks for being here. Like I said, sorry I'm late. This whole setup was not working well. My Wi-Fi wasn't cooperating. And then I went to uh, Frank the Tank. What's happening? Uh, then I went to just my regular cell signal to do this. And it was messing with me. So finally I got this thing up and running. So we can do the giveaway. So how was your guys' 4th of July? Mine was pretty outstanding. Yes, Jack, you are in the, in the giveaway. Sorry, the, the description of this was, uh, well, like I was saying, this whole setup was just messing with me before I tried to get online here. <clears throat> but this is the giveaway. I'm going to give these people a few more minutes to get in here. You do not need to be present to win, but obviously we'd like to get a few people on the, uh, get a few people on the channel here to let them see everything. But yeah, my 4th of July was pretty sweet. We went to a wedding. It was hot as all get out. Uh, pretty much sweat, 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 but, uh, and our, our fireworks show was, uh, was as we were driving home, we pretty much, the panoramic view was just fireworks going off all around us as we're driving down the highway. It was, it was actually pretty cool. Kind of, kind of a different way to see things than just sitting on a lake like we normally do and watching it over the lake, uh. And we had a good time with friends and family. So, hey, you know, it is what it is. I'm going to give people a couple more minutes. So, I was just reading an article today about the uh, about COVID and and how it was, you know, there are a lot of players, or not a lot of players, but there are some players with COVID. I'm, I'm, I hope that they don't pull this video because for me saying that. Um they have the, the heebie-jeebies, we'll call it that. Uh, but there are several players that, that have the heebie-jeebies, and I'm wondering if it isn't going to really interfere with the season. You know it's going to, and you got to figure it, the season's going to get canceled. Uh, yep, that's the that's the Robert that we're giving away, the number one prize there, Braden. So, uh, so hopefully we have a season, but I, I somehow feel like... Uh, I feel like it's not going to happen, which is really, really sad. And then that makes you wonder what's going to happen. You know, two cards. Where, what are the, what is their value going to end up being? Not that that's what it's all about, but I mean, at the same time, you know, who's going to keep buying them? Is it going to put the card companies in a bad position? So it's all kind of, all kind of sad. So. All right. All right, Brayden. Did you... NBA Pro, what's happening? Gotcha, Brayden. Did you go over up to the uh, the Facebook page and comment on that? Because that is where I'm actually pulling... Um, I'm pulling comments from. Frank, I think you did. You know what? I tell you what, because I think a couple people haven't done the Facebook page. I mean, I'd really appreciate it if you go over and like my Facebook page. But I think what I'm going to do is... Hey, Brayden, don't worry about it. What I'm going to do here is that I'm just going to pick the... I'm going to pick the comments off the YouTube page. That way, uh, That way everyone can get in there. Uh, YouTube, random comment picker, there's that, pull that up, and let's see, I gotta go get the, so over 
here. My videos. And there we go. Let's pause that. Sorry, guys. Sure. Copy. And paste. There we go. All right. Well, I think we got enough people. That's all right, Frank. That's all right. I'm, I'm going to... I'm just going to have it go off the YouTube, off the uh, initial announcement video uh, where I told everyone to comment there and on Facebook. So I don't blame you. A lot of people don't do Facebook or don't do Facebook anymore for whatever reason. I get it. I, I'm kind of like done with the drama of Facebook and uh, I think I may be leaving Facebook soon too, at least by my personal page. Uh, the Brewers Card Charter page will stay up because there's no politics or or uh, any current events. We'll just leave it at current events uh, on my page other than uh, baseball and brewers and good stuff. So uh, I will probably keep that page up, but my personal page will probably come down. All right. Are you guys ready? I know I'm ready. I've been want wanting to do this for a long time. So... Let's get some YouTube comments here. Kevin, what's happening, man? And if you guys didn't check it out, go over and check out Vicar's page. Vicar had a huge giveaway uh, two nights ago. Uh, I, I I personally got some really sweet stuff. Uh, it, I really appreciate that, Kevin. I, I have done nothing but talk about it to my friends. Uh, I'm pretty sure the wedding party or you know, the wedding that I was at yesterday was pretty sick of me talking about it. Um, yeah, so it was pretty sweet. You got to go check that out, guys. All right. So I am going to do the first one. Third place card, the Jason Dominguez. Some think that maybe that should be the second place, and then this should be the third place. But I think you got a better chance of getting something good out of this. This, I mean, does have a good chance of going up, but we're going to do that as third place. So third place coming up right now. At you. And I hit start. Do it. My Wi-Fi has been wonky. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. And we have positive breaks. Positive breaks. You win. The Jason Dominguez. Lou Rock, what's happening, man? So positive breaks. I didn't see you in the room yet, but that's you. You got that. Uh, shoot me an email with your address so I can get that off to you. All right, now we're gonna go to Tops Sealed 10 2020 Series 1. I think it's the better of the two series. Yes, you can get the Robert in the Series 2, but overall, you know, I just, th there's a whole lot more names in Series 1, I think. So definitely, uh, definitely a great prize. And those things, those suckers were hard to get. All right, now let's pick another winner. All right, round and round we go. And boom, the one and only Bud Stoney. There you go, Bud. Reckon you got that. And I think we've already emailed between each other, so go ahead and uh, shoot me your address at your email, or at my email, and I will get that one off to you. All right. And last but not least, we are going for the Big Daddy, Lewis Robert. 78 out of 150. 
Who's going to win it? First, let me tell you. No, I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. Let's pick another winner. All right. I should have. NBA Pro. NBA Pro, you won the Lewis Robert Blue. Gypsy Queen, congratulations. Congratulations to you all. I want to thank all of you for being a subscriber. Uh, I really appreciate it. Like I said in my announcement video, uh, I didn't expect to hit 250. I thought I would get to 100, and that would be it. So I really appreciate all of you. Now, I do have some cards I, I can open if you guys want to keep going. I've got this box of a prism blaster i managed to pick that up anyone want to see me open that and give me a thumbs up in the chat anybody bueller 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 Uh, go to my um uh, to my about page on Facebook there, and my uh, my email is in there. It's just Brewers Cards Forever at gmail dot com though. No Bud Stoney, thank you for being here. All right, anybody want to see me open this? Oh, I'm just oh, you know what? I'm gonna open it anyway. You guys can stay. Hang out. Watch me open this. I haven't opened any of the prism yet. So I'm kind of excited to do it. I've seen a couple other people break it. And I just happened to run into this box. I was lucky because I know it was stocked on shelves. And everybody yanked all of it. Along with the Series 2. Um... Clint, what's happening, man? I didn't see. When'd you sneak in here? Jay's mix. Big thumbs up. All right. I didn't need any currents, but I just figured maybe somebody might want to stick around. If you do, cool. If you don't, hey, giveaway's over. Go do what you gotta. <clears throat> no, that's cool, bud. I totally get that. You know, I get busy, and uh, but. Hey, I appreciate you stopping in. I appreciate you being a subscriber. Send me that stuff and I will uh, I will get that 10 off to you. All right. What the heck? All right, let's go. Let's go. So we got that and then bonus pack. <clears throat> I guess we'll leave the bonus pack for that. It felt feels kind of thick compared to the rest of them. I love shiny cards, so this is, I mean, I'm, I'm kind of in the same boat as a lot of people. I don't like the fact that they don't have the actual team names or the team logos on it, but uh, the shiny makes up for it. Not only that, but a lot of the hits that you can potentially get also make up for it too. So it is what it is. Sheldon Noyce, Brandon Woodruff, Brewer, boom, I'll take that. And then I got a Max Scherzer Prism Refractor, if you would, but they just call it Prism. That's pretty sweet. And a Mitch Garber. Hey, Pete. Pete Miller, what's happening, dude? <clears throat> Excuse me. Now we're just busting some packs. We did the giveaway. You can rewind a little bit and go see who uh, who won, who didn't win. All right, so we've got a Luis Castillo. And then Mike Yastrzemski. Now, that one's different. This one is numbered 54 out of 75. Very nice. Very nice. Put that over there. 
For a second there, I almost thought it was, uh, oh, no, but that's yellow. Okay. thought it might have been a Robert for there for a second, but it's a Kibrian Hayes now on deck. And that is not numbered. And then Corey Seager. I actually work with a guy named Corey Seager, but he doesn't like baseball. So he's not impressed, which I get. All right, next on deck, Kirby Yates. Pitcher for the San Diego Padres. Dallas Keuchel. I was kind of hoping the Brewers would get Dallas Keuchel during that whole thing, but uh, no, no dice. What does that say? Sc oh, scorching, gotcha, scorching. Manny Machado. And that one's not numbered, but it's a good-looking card, even though I don't like Manny Machado for stepping on uh, Aguilar at first base. And then Anthony Rizzo, Cub. Been on my channel. You know how I feel about Cubs. All right. And then we got a Jacob deGrom. Cy Young Award winner times two, not with the best numbers of the world. <clears throat> well, not the best win totals in the world, world. but it, it no longer matters. Ken Giles. Then we got a green, Luke Weaver. Ooh, that's pretty. That is pretty. Now, it doesn't look like it's numbered. No, not numbered. But that way, a good looking card. And then we got Matt Carpenter, St. Louis Cardinal. I don't know. I'm, uh... Well, you guys know. I'm not a huge fan of... Oh, what's that? We'll find out here in a minute. Definitely want to settle. Kyle Seeger. I got a Brad Keller. Cardinal fan. Hey, we just had a Cardinal. Matt Carpenter. And I was saying, well... I wasn't going to say how I feel about the Cardinals because they beat the Brewers in the 82 World Series. And... Have always been a thorn in our side since we came to the National League. But anyway, Brad Keller. Then we got an Abraham Toro. Now that is like, is that just a regular prism? Must be. It still seems like super, super shiny. But my nephew is a huge Houston fan, so that will go off to them. And then we got an Instant Impact Juan Soto. <clears throat> Do you ever, I'm, I'm sure none of you here are old enough to remember SCTV, uh, kind of where John Candy got his start and uh, Rick Moranis and uh, who else? A few other comedians from the 80s, but uh, you can see it in 3D. Okay, that was your take. All right, let's move on. Get that out of the way. We got the last regular pack, and then we got the bonus pack. You got the bonus plan. Oh! All right. So then we got Lucas Giolito. Oh, we got a backwards Marco Luciano. Shall we turn it around? What is it? I feel like it's an autograph. What do you think? You think it's an autograph? Boom. Autograph. Marco Luciano. Plays for San Francisco. Clint, tell me about uh, Luciano. Is he awesome? Do I need to keep this? Do I need to sell it? What do I need to do with this? He's a shortstop. He's got any pop? Got any pop in the back? I don't know. We'll place that over there for future consideration although his autograph m l dot with a rainbow red i guess <laughs> yeah jay's mix it's, it's close uh actually both uh rick moranis and dave thomas played on sctv and they actually started 
the Great White North and, and the Strange Brew, the, the whole McKinsey Brothers thing on uh, SCTV. And then we got uh, Quinn Priester, top of the class. And then Orion Jensen, top of the class. All right, last pack. It's the bonus pack. See what we got in the bonus pack. Nothing thick. All right, we got a purple Kirby Yates. Got a purple Dallas Keuchel. We got a purple Justin Burlander, and a purple Lance Lynn. And then. We got this funky. Ooh, look at that. That's funky. Show that funky baseball card, white boy. Okay, anyway. Pete Alonzo. Very nice. And then a Kevin Newman. And then, last but not least, a stargazing Clayton Kershaw. Very cool. That would probably be pretty cool in a 3D view too, right? Okay, enough of that. All right, so that was my first taste of Prism. Nothing in there made me jump out of my seat. I mean, cool, I got a brand of Woodruff, you know. Hometown Proud. Got that Yastrzemski. And I got, I mean, I got an autograph out of it. I mean, you can't complain about that. I mean, what are the chances of getting an autograph in a retail um in a retail blaster box. So that was pretty good. All right. Anybody else want to watch some more packs? I got a couple more packs sitting here just in case. I've got some 2019 gallery that I picked up at the Walmart at the same time. I got that prism and then I got a 2017 uh, Series 1. <laughs> Take off, eh? You hoser. I used to listen to the album all the time. All the time. I I had that thing memorized. My uh, my best friend Brad and I would go running. And I would be either quoting the, the Great White North album. Or spouting off Monty Python skits. Uh, he was struggling to keep breath. And I was just spouting off the entire time. All these different... Uh, all these different TV shows. All right. So what do we got in the gallery? We got a Luke Voigt. He looks like he's constipated in that picture. And then we got a Mitch Hanniger. He looks like he just lost his mom. And then Brandon Lau. And then we go sideways for a David Potteralta. Ah, Ronald Acuna Jr. Second year card. Very nice. And we got a Max Scherzer. Hall of Fame. Hank Aaron. See, I'm, I don't like the fact they put Atlanta Braves on there. Uh, because he started off as a Milwaukee Brave. Yeah, he was an Atlanta Brave for a while. But did a... Okay, so I'm going to try to do it. Hold on a second. <coughs> got to clear the throat. Oh, yeah, no, that's not happening with that phlegm in my throat. I'm sorry. No, I don't have the heebie-jeebies, but I definitely have a sinus thing going on right now. All right. Um, all right, so, yeah, no, I wish they really would have put him as a Milwaukee Brave or a Milwaukee Brewer because that's where he ended his career and where he ended up, you know, with his last home run that he ever hit. But uh, I'm still, it's Hank Aaron. And then we got a Chris Bryant. Yay. And then we got a Kevin Biggio rookie. That's nice. I'll take that. And then we got Jalen Beeks. He almost kind of has like that come hither look to him. Not that I would do that, but anyway. Corey Kluber. Right on. And then Josh Naylor rookie card. All right. 
I'm gonna do one more pack of that. Brewers cards forever. Yes, that is the one. Congratulations again, NBA Pro. It's an awesome card. I know I was excited when I pulled pulled it from a pack, and then I was like, you know what? I really don't collect Robert that much. I mean, I got a couple of his cards, but uh, I figured I'd pass that along to somebody. I figured they might enjoy it a lot more than I will. So congratulations again. Kyle Tucker, rookie card. My nephew will like that. Christian Stewart. St. Louis Cardinal Lane Thomas rookie card. Trevor Story. I got something back here. Ryan Helsley. Oops, let me pick that up a little bit. All right, what do we got behind here? It's a Noah Syndergaard. It's a Heritage. It's not autographed. But that's still a pretty sweet looking card. I love the backs on that. That's pretty sweet. That old cartoon style with everything. Yeah, that's that's pretty nice. All right, and then we're gonna go to Reese Hoskins here, a Luis Severino. I see the Luis Severino is like out uh, out for the season again. I thought I read that. A Victor Robles apprentices, Chris Paddock rookie card. Javi Baez, Cub. Nick Senzel, rookie card. And then we got the security card, in case you're not feeling very secure. <clears throat> in case you didn't notice, I cha changed up some of the cards in my background. Oh, that reminds me, all of you that won today also will receive one of these, my own personal autographed tops cards. Right on. Okay, so, uh, so I got two guys up here, Papa J and Donald Blomdahl, who uh, I both follow pretty religiously. If you know Donald or you watch Donald, you'll get that joke. And then I got my nephew in the background. That's his, that's his autographed rookie card. Hopefully I don't knock the camera over here. I'm going to knock the camera over. I'm not going to grab it, but that's my nephew's autographed tops cards and they're actually the, all three of them are the reasons why I got one of mine. <clears throat> and then, of course, my Ricky Vaughn rookie card there. I love that card. And then I have my Michael Jordan rookie card. I love that card even more. It's definitely the most expensive card that I have. I say if uh, I got it graded, it would probably be six, maybe a seven if I was lucky. I should send it off to get it graded, but... Uh, yeah, I don't think I'm going to. I really did the thought of me putting that in the mail and sending it just really, uh, really gives me pause. Uh, I got it while I had my card shop, and it's kind of like special to me. I also have the rookie sticker somewhere. Uh, it's in another box, but uh, yeah, I don't want to give that bad boy up. And then I got my bow. So, anyway. All right, I'm going to hit this one last pack, 2017, see if we can get anything good out of there, and then I'm going to call it a night. I never get off on Saturdays, so by me getting off to go to the wedding yesterday, uh, oh wow guys, there is a thicky in there, and it's not... not focusing so we definitely got something um i never get saturdays off so to get this saturday off i'm having to work like an, a lot of 10 11 hour days this week so i gotta get all geared up for that <clears throat> i don't think it is just jeff let's take a look we will find out so we got a hector santiago alex bregman rookie and uh Gold Cup on the same card. That's very nice. I don't know. Should I give that to my nephew or should I keep that for myself? Well, I'll give it to my nephew. I really don't have a whole lot of use for it. So Vizcaino, Kurt Suzuki, Joe Musgrove, rookie. We'll put that in my nephew's pile. Jackie Bradley Jr., Aaron Hicks, 
I think I saw that. That's actually a, an actual card card. That is not a uh, that is not a spacer. Joey Vato. Why are these cards? These cards are like really in here weird. Lester. Daniel Murphy. Albert Pujols. David Ortiz. Actually, I feel like was there a card stuck to that? Yes, there was. Stash! What's happening, man? Paul Goldschmidt, Father's Day card. All right. Ortiz. First pitch, Louis Coronel, Chase Field. Who is Louis Coronel? Dubbed the New Artist of the Year honoree at 2014 Latin Billboard Music Awards. Okay, cool. I care. Um, that's a, oh, that's it right there. Now, Max Scherzer. So, Aaron Nola with a nice little pinstripe right there. Game used memorabilia. Not numbered, but hey. Anytime you get a relic out of a out of a retail pack, a clearance retail pack at that. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna say something here real quick, and I'm not gonna do it because I haven't done it. But the one thing that I see everybody doing whenever they get the the relic card, the first thing that they want to do is touch it. And I'm like, oh look, I I touched it. I touched. But you're getting your grease and your finger dirt, and maybe your heebie-jeebies all over this card. So don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay. All right. Last of the pack. Bryant. Lorenzo Cain. That is a good looking card. I don't think I have that card. Except for, that's why, because it's a Royals. He's on the Royals there. I don't care. Steve Pierce. <laughs> right? <laughs> I know I want to. I do, I do. Righteous Chef, those are bad touches. Don't do that. <laughs> Take off, eh? You hoser. Have a good night, man. Appreciate you being here. Jeremy Hellickson. Miami Marlins team card. Now, this was when Yelich was still on the Marlins, and he's uh, he's not on there. And then we got a Jameson Talion, Matt Adams, and Ryan Flaherty, Carlos Carrasco, Alex Wood. Hey, Jeff, thanks, thanks for stopping, man. Appreciate you. Have a great one. Uh, Yasmani Tomas. Nathan Eovaldi, and yay, security. So that's it for that. I kind of want to open some more cards, though. What do you guys think? I mean, I know I said I was going to stop after that, and I, we're only 37 minutes in. What do you guys think? Think I should open something else? I kind of, kind of want to open another... I know what I'll do. Hold on. Yeah. My chair doesn't want to back up nicely. All right, sorry, guys. I got one more pack of 2017, and I got a pack of Bowman Platinum from 19, and then I <laughs> touch more rocks. <laughs> All right, so we're going to open this first one here. 2017, another Jackie Bradley Jr. It's like deja vu. Another Aaron Hicks, deja vu. Robert Gazelman, rookie card. Joey, but it's like a deja vu pack. Joey Vato. John Lester, at least this time I got Mookie Betts instead of Ortiz. 
All right, NBA Pro, appreciate that, and I appreciate you, and I will get that out. Uh, I'm more than likely I'll get that out tomorrow. Bob Odenkirk, I love, love Just Call Saul and him in Breaking Bad. So even though, even though it's on a on a Cubs card, uh, I'm gonna have to keep this one. Ah, uh, breaks my heart. But anyway, Aaron Nola, Brandon Geyer, Tyler Chatwood, Brian Goodwin rookie, and a Kyle Baraclaw. I know, right? Odenkirk is freaking sweet. I love him in, like, everything that he does. Odenkirk. Yeah, Odenkirk. All right. All right, this is the last pack, guys. I got some other stuff I need to get done. I have a feeling my granddaughter is going to come busting through the door any second. She's been very patient. I told her grandpa's got to do his thing. And so I'm afraid she's going to come busting through the door any minute now. I think I got the John Goodman. Uh, my favorite is the um, Masahiro. Um, why can't I think of his last name now? The Master Chef, anyway. Uh, throwing the first pitch for Seattle. I actually have that in my collection because I'm a, a big, uh, not master chef. Oh my goodness. Iron Chef. There we go. Iron Chef. Yes. Yes, it's a Cardinals card. It got way too much attention there. You're right. And we got a Ryland Bannon. Oops. Bring that up a little bit. Morimoto. Yes. Thank you, Chris. Yes, Morimoto. He was one of my favorites on uh, the Japanese Iron Chef. Uh, I loved I I don't know why, you know, always having to watch the subtitles. But the Fukuri-san, uh, you know, and he said that so often. It was just ridiculous. All right. James Marvell. Pedro. Vote for Pedro, guys. Vote for Pedro. Kristen Javier. Renowned rookies, Josh James. I'll give that to him, to my nephew. A Reese Hoskins. Aubrey Plaza. I don't know if I've seen that one. I'm about to go through. I don't know if I really want to undertake this, but really pretty much I've just been opening all these cards, you know, and I pull the Brewers aside or anything, some other stuff that's from my PC, but I really haven't organized anything other than like the 2020 stuff, like stuff like this just goes in a box. I'm going to have to pull it all out and organize it, and I'm not looking forward to it. I know it's going to be a huge task, um, but I tell you what, if I see RV Plaza, uh, I'll let you know. 2016. I haven't opened up a whole lot of 2016 to be honest. I've opened up a little bit, but I will. Uh, I will take a look. Hey, Stone. Hey, there was something I wanted to tell you, Stoney. After right after you left, and then I totally forgot. Oh, of course it'll come to me as soon as I shut the the camera off. It'll come back to me, and I'll be like, Oh yeah, that's what I wanted to tell him. All right, and then we got a Charlie Blackman. Shout out Apex Cards. Former Brewer Chris Davis. And then... Oh, no, I was going to ask you, Stoney, do you want me to open the tin here on, on the channel? Or do you want to want me to send it to you? You can open up on your channel. The last card in this one is Eric Hosmer. All right. So, we'll, no pressure, because I really don't care either way. I mean, I kind of want to go and do my thing, but if you want me to open up here, I will definitely do that for you. Oh, 
Park your car brakes. What's happening, man? I'll make sure that they get bagged up and um, and and packaged in there safely again. All right, tell you what, let me flip a quarter, and we'll figure. Well, we'll do this the democratic way, right? If I have a quarter, I got my lighter. Oh, there's a quarter. All right, here we go. Oh no, it's not a quarter. It's my Marine Corps toy or coin. Marine Corps, let's see if I can get it in focus. There we go. Marine Corps. In the back. So this will be Tails. The Toys for Tot side will be Tails. And the good old Eagle Globe and Anchor will be Heads. Alright, so. <laughs> I just knocked the autograph card over. Alright. Alright. Oh, except I didn't say which would be which. Ooh, Parker. All right. Yeah. All right. So, heads, it, we will do the break here. Uh, tails, I will send it to you. You can do the break there. All right. There we go. Oh, now I knocked Donald over. All right. Now, I'm going to give this here. And heads. So, let's open this bad boy. Donald, I'm sorry I knocked you over, man. All right. So let's break this bad boy open. Then I can go and do the things that I gotta do. All right. So Stoney, who's who's your uh, who's your favorite player or favorite team? Before I start this, that way I know who to be excited about. I mean, obviously I'm gonna be excited about Brewers, but that's me. I want to be excited for you. Bueller. Bueller. All right, so right there on the top, we've got the Flaherty. Let's turn it to the side. Let's see. It doesn't look like there's any any thickness. Red Sox. Ah, PC Alvarez. Good choice. Yeah, I like Alvarez too. I think I mentioned it before, but I actually got to see him play when the Brewers. Uh, with the Brewers, ugh. when the Astros came to Milwaukee and we played the Astros, I got to see him play. I was definitely impressed by him. That he is. Uh... Oh yeah, yeah. Oh no, I did follow that up. Uh, I I am sending uh, autograph cards with all of these. All right, so Red Sox. And Alvarez, we are looking for. So we're going to start off with a Jack Flaherty. And then a Brandon Jury. Eloy Jimenez, Gold Cup card. Isan Diaz, former Brewer that was traded away for uh, da, 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 for Yelich. Fireballer, Aroldis Chapman. Malik Smith. Jacoby Jones. Trey Turner. Jose Quintana, Max Kepler, Tommy Pham. Tommy Pham used to give the Brewers fits when we played the Cardinals when he was a Cardinal, so I don't care for him too much. Anthony Rendon, Andrew Chafin, Jorge Soler, Anthony Rendon, Steven Strasburg, Mitch Hanniger. Is 
Is that the regular, is that, or is this a short print? I can't tell. It doesn't look like the regular card, I don't think. I don't know. Is that, I can't read it. Can you read it? I'm blind right now. Okay. Well, let's continue on. Soto World Series. No, because it's not in the middle. Because it would be in the middle if it was a Hunter Dozier. Oh, but thank you. Hopefully, uh, maybe we'll get some. I appreciate that. Nico Horner. Justin Turner. Oscar Mercado. Garrett Cooper. Brad Hand. I mean, you know he had to be a pitcher, right? He's, he's got the name for it. Dario Agrizal. Razia, uh, Razel, Razel Iglesias, that guy. Anthony Rendon. Decades best. Tom Seaver, right on. Brewer, Robin Young. I'm actually going to send you this anyway because I already have like 37 of these. I bought, Actually, the first one I bought. I bought from my LCS thinking, I don't know that I'm going to get all that much tops or whatever or the chances of getting it may be remote. Uh, and then after I bought one, of course, that's when I got them all. I got like, I don't know, probably five or six of them. So I'll send that to you anyway. Uh, Glaber Torres. Good, good. I'm glad. I got a Rosario. Ah, buzzer Beater. Altuve. Uh, Nolan Arenado. Mr. Castillo. Then, of course, you got your Reese Hoskins inserts. Oh, look at that. You couldn't have got a better Chrome. That is awesome. Boston Red Sox. Chrome. Decades best. Very nice. And then we got a Kevin Biggio. Chrome. Uh, turkey Red. And then Aaron Nola. Let's flop this around. Nick Markakis. Luke Voigt. You know, I haven't heard anything about 10s for Series 2. But then again, I haven't seen any Series 2 in the store. Or at least the, the retail. Uh, the only thing I see... I had to go to my LCS and... He had like a hanger pack there. So I'm kind of thinking he's gone and cherry picked all the Walmarts, which is kind of like, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. But uh, I, I had I bought my jumbo box from my LCS. That's the only one that I've seen or picked up. Yeah, nice bike trout, definitely. All right, I'm stealing Brandon Woodruff. There we go. What's a what's an Independence Day? Which one? Which one? Oh, the Aaron Nola. You are right. You are right. I don't even you know. Thirty two out of seventy five. Good catch. Good catch, Parker. Uh actually, I have the Brewers team card, like the the um, or was it the other one? Yeah, no, I think it was Independence Day. And I totally skipped by it. It was like, oh, it's a Brewers team card. But it ended up being the uh, Independence Day card. Right? Yeah, good catch. Luke Voigt. Nick Markakis. Then uh, Trout. Nelson Cruz, former Brewer. Wish we still had him. Yoan Mancata. Frenmil Reyes. David Dahl. Adbert Alzale, Adalberto Mondesi, Jose Jorrena, Randy Azarena, Eric Fidi, Tyler O'Neill. See, like, uh, who was the O'Neill that played back in the 80s? Played for the Mets. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I will I will sleeve both that Aranola and the Chrome Red Sox for you. Uh, 
Uh, Thornton, Muncy, Munoz. Yeah, Paul O'Neill, that's the one, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I Oh, Stoney, that's who you were talking about before. Yeah, that's right, yep. Yeah, I will definitely sleeve them. Actually, I might even... I might even... Um, top load them, too, because they'll sit nicely on top of the... Um, on top of the package, like, right here, because that's how I carry some of my cards around, so... I will put I will put them in uh, a top loader as well. Master and Apprentice, Zach Wheeler, German Marquez or Herman Marquez, Jake Lamb, Silence of the Lambs, Ben Gamma. I love this photo, and it's also it's floating it's floating away. Thanks, Tony. Yeah, I wouldn't. I didn't figure you would be. Starling Marte, Brandon Crawford, Austin Meadows. Oh, Yankee team card. So if you're a Yankee or you're a Red Sox fan, I mean, you hate the Yankees. See, like I hate the Cardinals. No offense, Cardinals. Uh, 1990, because yeah. Justin Verlander. Ah, look at that. Aristides Aquino. I will also sleeve him up. Matter of fact, I'm going to go down here and make sure I pull these other cards now. Do you want that Biggio sleeved up too? <laughs> yeah well people hate on my packers too like like crazy you know and there's a reason for it i mean they're good the cardinals have been, have been so consistently good over all the years it's ridiculous and that's part of the reason part of the reason why i hate on them especially now that we're in the same division but uh, even when we played you guys in the World Series and all that, you know, I uh, I get it. Cool. Will do, Stoney. All right. Austin Riley, Trevor Richards, Kenta Maeda, Mike Estremsky, Future Stars, Carlos Radon, and a Hunter Renfro. I know. I know, right? With Lux and May and uh, who's that other guy I'm trying to think of? There's another kit, cat that uh, that is a good rookie for them. Actually, a buddy of mine, Chad Fonville, played for the Dodgers many, many years ago. Uh, I was, I actually lost his rookie card. Um, I actually lost it in a fire. I had a lot of my stuff go, go in a fire back in 2003. And yeah, been meaning to try to get, find his card online. So, all right, cool. I'm glad you like that Red Sox card. That is a that is a pretty sweet card. I'm glad that we got that. I was like, hopefully we get something decent Red Sox here. All right, so we got we've been on here 54 minutes, and I should probably wrap this up. Uh, again, I want to humbly thank all of you for being subscribers uh i didn't think i'd make it this far i guess i'm gonna i'm gonna shoot for 250 and uh or not i'm sorry not 250 500 see how that goes we'll have a big giveaway at 500 if i make it that far uh you know and i'm not gonna I'm not going to lose my passion for this just because uh, I love baseball and I love baseball cards. I'm not here to I'm not here to impress anybody, um, but I am definitely here to uh, to have fun. So uh, I appreciate all of you watching. I appreciate all you being here, and uh, I thoroughly enjoy every single one of you. 
And you know what? You guys go out there. You have a fantastic night and a fantastic week. Uh, my schedule this week is a little bit wonky. Uh, so I don't know how many lunchtime rips I'm going to get to do this week. I know the end of this past week, I got kind of bogged down with work. And I, anytime you don't see a lunchtime rip except on Sunday, it means that uh, I'm working through lunch and I don't get to eat lunch that day. So... Uh, yeah, never fun thing when I don't get to do that. Anyway, you guys, thank you again. Have a great night, and we'll catch you on the flip side. Bye.